What's up you guys, it's Steve here and stimulus checks are gonna be going out across the nation in various states. I've got nine different ones, some of which might shock you. I'm gonna be covering all the details and letting you know what states are gonna be sending out state stimulus checks and this is your stimulus check update. Now, I'm gonna be covering all of these for you, getting you caught up on the latest as states are taking action as we're still waiting to see if there's gonna be a fourth federal level stimulus check. And for those of you that missed my video earlier this morning, you might wanna check it out as negotiations are taking place. However, Senator Joe Manchin just dropped a bomb on the talks for stimulus. Like I said, if you missed that video, you might wanna check it out. Now, like I said though, states are gonna be sending out these provisions to help out people at this time with soaring gas prices, high inflation, and everything taking place. And some of these are pretty huge. We're talking up to $2,000 for individuals in one state, you guys. So I'm gonna be covering all the details, get you caught up on the latest. But before we dive in, if you could do me a quick favor, and that is if you appreciate these updates, keeping you up to speed on everything going on, if you could just take a quick second to smash that like button for me, helps me out a ton with the YouTube algorithm. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Also, leave your comments, share this out. If this is your first time here and you'd like to stay up to date, totally free, you can come join the Ram Fam. It's free, why not? All you gotta do is smash that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell. If you got any specific questions for me, I'm easy to get a hold of directly. Just hop onto Instagram, shoot me a DM at steveram3. I'll do my best to get you any answers to any questions that you have. And consider joining my second channel, Steve Ram Finance, to learn about growing wealth and personal finance. More content on the way. I'll pin a comment down below if you're interested. Click the link, go subscribe. If you wanna learn about investing in real estate, stocks, crypto, starting businesses, that channel is gonna be for you. But with that being said, you guys, let's dive into the latest on stimulus checks on nine different states that we have updates on in just a few days. Some of these checks are up to $2,000. All right, so let's go ahead and dive right in and links to all of these articles are gonna be in the description below if you'd like to check out any of them in detail. These have all come out in the past couple days. This first one in just the last 12 hours. So first up, Missouri House GOP, Republicans, pitches a $500 tax break for individuals. The article says, Missouri residents who file income taxes will be eligible for a $500 tax credit under a new Republican proposal that Democrats pan on Tuesday, yesterday. The proposal by Republican House budget leaders would set aside $1 billion in state funding for tax credits. Married couples filing jointly would get $1,000 under this new plan and top House Republicans said that passing this tax break will be the main priority as lawmakers near their mid-May deadline to finalize this legislation. So you could be getting $500 for individuals in the state of Missouri. Up next, we have an update for you in California. Now we had heard $400 per registered vehicle up to two, so up to $800 for gas stimulus checks in California. Well, we have an update for you. This just coming out, new details, a Newsom's rebate proposal released in so-called trailer bill. In his gas tax rebate proposal released last week, Newsom did not specify the rebate amount or the value ceiling for eligible vehicles. So we had heard this before, but now we're hearing this could be changing. They're changing possibly eligibility requirements and the amounts. We might see the amount go up or down depending on what they decide. Now they said the allotment of the stimulus that's gonna be provided is set, but they're gonna be seeing what they're gonna be sending out, how much, the amounts, and the eligibility. Now, as that comes out, I'll be sure to let you know. Link in the description below to this article. Just kind of summarize that one for you. Next up is Delaware rebate bill fast-tracked out of the house. It says Delaware lawmakers are fast-tracking a bill that would spend some of the state's record-setting surplus by mailing out $300 checks to every Delawarean as the proposal clears the house on Thursday. So in Delaware, you could be seeing a stimulus check as well. Up next, here's a big one, Illinois. Taxpayers to receive direct payments, AKA stimulus checks, grocery sales tax to be suspended as a part of the Illinois budget deal, and the gas tax will also be frozen through the start of 2023 under the agreement. Now the article jumping down says, according to lawmakers, the state's 1% sales tax on grocery will be suspended for the entirety of the new fiscal year, which officials say will save taxpayers up to $400 million through July 1st of 2023. The state's fuel tax, which was slated to 
to increase in July due to inflation will instead be in frozen at 39 cents a gallon through January 1st of 2023, with taxpayers saving up to 70 million. Property tax rebates also for $300 per household will also be included in the budget, along with an expansion of the EITC, the Earned Income Tax Credit, in the state. So I shared with you in a previous video updates about EITC and how you could get a $7,000 uh, rebate on a federal level for the EITC. And here you can also get it in the state of Illinois. And lastly, finally, families will receive direct checks, aka stimulus checks, from the state pending approval of the budget. Each individual will be eligible for a check of up to $50,000 with households receiving $100 per child. So a lot going on in the state of Illinois. Next up, we have Virginia. Virginia Democrats propose gas rebates in lieu of suspending the gas tax. Democrats in the Virginia House of Delegates are once again rejecting a plan proposed by Governor Yunkin to suspend the state's gas tax during a time when prices at the pump continue to soar. The Democratic caucus in the House has proposed rebates of $50 per car or up to $100 per household as an alternative to the governor's plan. So you might also be seeing some gas stimulus checks in the state of Virginia. And also, up next, West Virginia. Gas tax relief battle continues in West Virginia. Call it a battle of gas tax relief, but will drivers get benefits? We now have a dueling proposal of legislations, but will Governor Justice call a special session of the House delegates in the state Senate? Now, jumping down, it says, I think the simpler that you keep the process, the easier the process will be to be able to get other legislators on board with you as well. So I believe that we would just do a flat fee. Let's go ahead and do $100 rebate checks we're hearing. So that is currently being proposed in West Virginia, $100 checks. Up next, Arkansas state surplus nears 500 million. Governor is weighing the possibilities of relief for taxpayers. And it says Arkansas Governor Asa Hutchins discussed the possibility of additional relief for taxpayers on Monday because of high gas prices and inflation as the state's surplus of fiscal year approaches $500 million. Now in Arkansas, they have not released any details, but they are taking into consideration stimulus checks. Now up next, I also let you know about New York. Senator Daphne Jordan advances a common sense amendment to the state's budget to establish $1,000 Family Freedom Inflation Relief Checks to Help New York Families Being Hurt by Inflation. This one coming out about a week ago. And lastly, you guys, the big one, $2,000 checks. Governor Wolf's $2,000 plan could put money in the pockets of Pennsylvanians. This just coming out two days ago. A proposed plan could send thousands of dollars to Pennsylvania residents. Unfortunately, not everybody is going to be receiving state stimulus checks like we saw on a federal level. Now, Governor Tom Wolf is looking to spend some of the cash before it is sent back to Washington. Harrisburg is sitting on $1.7 billion from the American Rescue Plan, and the governor has plans of his own. So you guys, this is all from that stimulus package we saw back in March of 2021, the American Rescue Plan. Pennsylvania still has not tapped those funds, and they're planning on taking it and sending out stimulus checks to help out their residents of $2,000. Now, as more comes out on that, I'll be sure to keep you up to date here on the channel. So there you have it, you guys, nine different states sending out gas, stimulus checks, rebates, inflation checks, whatever you want to call it. It's going to be checks going directly to you that's going to be hitting your bank account. And as more information comes out on any of these, I'll be sure to let you know here on the channel so you know what's happening and what's available to you. And as always, you guys, thank you so much for joining me. If you've made it this far and you haven't already, don't forget, if you appreciate the content, just take a quick second, smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm. Helps on my channel a ton. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Also, leave your comments, share this out. If this is your first First time here and you like to stay up to date totally free so why not come join the ram fam just smash the subscribe button turn on that notification bell i'll keep you up to speed on everything taking place if you got any specific questions for me shoot them to me in the dm on instagram at steve ram 3 and consider joining my second channel steve ram finance to learn about growing wealth and personal finance but with that being said you guys thank you so much for joining me once again and i will catch you in the next one take care god bless this is steve